So, let's plug it. So, it's obvious it should be the internals. Of course, if this is not the carbon brush, this will not work. Even if I replace the carbon brushes. This is the original carbon brush when it was bought. So as you can see, there's a line there. It's an indication that uh, we're almost we're out. Okay. There, there's a line there. We'll compare it with the new brush. So there's a line here. Where's that? It should reflect the light there. Uh, typically, that is one fourth inch from the from the braided wire or the terminals. So this is a new brush. Okay, you will discuss this one later. There are two circles, right? Two copper uh, something there. And here's the other one. There. Oh, there are two each. See, there's a line here. This is actually an indicator that your the brush life span is from this end going to this line here. If you are buying original Bosch carbon brush, this is this is actually the auto cut off feature of the carbon brush. Okay. This one here, that circle. It is spring loaded and it stops your armature from rotating when the carbon brush is worn out. Also this one here. When it's worn out, there's a spring load mechanism here that pops out. I still don't understand how it works. This is the tool. Okay, we don't have one here. There's only one circle that's the braided wire or the terminal of the carbon brush. Okay, let's remove this. Remove, remove. Yes. Place it with a new one. 
Alright, go. Just plug it the same as it was installed. Okay. This is the back side. I call it the back side. And this, if this is the front and this is the back, or just call it the dimpled part. You see small pliers, or okay, just show you how it can be done without any pliers. No, it can't. It's very hard because this is new. Just use any small pliers. I'm tired of finding my small pliers. Just push it there. Okay. Then goes in the carbon brush make sure the wire side is away from here although it will still function that way but this is just better position First the screwdriver, just use the scissor, put the spring back in place. There. The spring constantly pushes the carbon brush <coughs> into your commutator, into the commutator. to the second carbon brush Here we can see there are two circles. One, two. This is the auto disconnect. There. It, it, it's pop out. Prevents the armature from turning thereby preventing damage to the commutator there so this is the new one there okay dimple side here difficult because I'm watching the camera I'll push From there Make sure the braided wire is not uh, tight, it's loose and free, like, like this, because if this was located here, it will be pulled there and 
it might get tangled here so it will prevent the spring from pushing the brush into the commutator there and hopefully this works before testing let's replace the cover for safety purposes this is the variable speed model oops Turn on. Yeah. Six. That was speed one. Six. And again, this this are the original. Bosch carbon brush with auto cut off feature worn out there there's the spring springy 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 it pops out it's actually retracted inside. Okay, that's it.